Utah making a pitch to Major League Baseball for an expansion team. Yeah, and now supporters have a choice on a site for that new stadium. Our Brian Malay joining us live in Salt Lake. And Brian, where would the new ballpark be built? The stadium would not be built where the current Smith's ballpark is, which in terms of its life is in the bottom of the ninth inning. This is where the Larry H. Miller Company, MLB owner in waiting, wants to play ball. The power district on North Temple. Why is North Temple the place? It's really exciting, and the reasons really are, are very apparent. Amanda Covington, Miller Company spokeswoman, went to bat for nearly 100 acres of location, location, location. It's strategically placed right between downtown Salt Lake City and the International Airport. North Temple is an incredible opportunity zone. State Senator Luz Escamilla says the site has hits and few errors, but what about the ballpark we already have, slated by the Millers to close in a neighborhood which felt that decision was a curveball which struck to the heart. Many of us moved here because we loved the dynamism and loved the dynamism and opportunity of fans and activity and the ambiance and also the economic potential of a stadium. That's why we're here. The Larry H. Miller Company says it took a swing at looking at the Smiths ballpark for a major league stadium. It says it would not fly here. Among other things, not enough room. Live in Salt Lake, Brian Malahi, KUTV 2 News. Brian, thank you. The group behind the push to bring that MLB team to Salt Lake City has announced several advisory boards to boost its expansion bid. Big League Utah named several prominent businesses, sports and political figures. If Salt Lake City lands a team, the group will create a foundation supporting priorities in the city's west side community. That could include funding for local organizations and initiatives focused specifically on the area's local businesses.